Welcome to Purple Bandidos, and welcome back to more Let's Play Pokemon White 2. I'm Purple Rodri. Last time we made it here to the Pokemon League. Today we are more than ready to enter it. It's been a very long journey, but I think our team is up for the challenge. As you can see, our team has trained up quite a bit, so I'm going to go ahead and just look over the moves before we head inside. As you can see, Nagini's level 55 with the Pekka Berry. The moves that Nagini's going to be going in with are Strength, Giga Drain, Leaf Blade, and Coil. Ace Row is going to be going in with the XP Share with Close Combat, Ice Punch, Aura Sphere, and Bulldoze. Barky is going to be going in with Flare Blitz, Crunch, Outrage, Flamethrower, and the Pekka Berry. Aza is going to be going in with Shadow Ball, Takedown, Psychic, Bite, and the Twisted Spoon. Nadar is going to be going in with Fly, Surf, Brave Bird, and Ice Beam with the item, the Person Berry. Mert's going to be going in with Hyper Beam, Crunch, Rock Slide, Dragon Claw, and the Dragon Fang. So our team is very well prepared. I'm actually very excited to do this. So let's go ahead and make our way inside. The Pokemon League is a place where you both pursue strength and express it. The way to express it is simple. You just have to beat the Elite Four and the Champion. You can start your challenge by battling any of the Elite Four, and if you defeat them all, you can challenge the Champion. However, I warn you, once you start your challenge, there's no turning back. You must keep battling until you defeat them all, or are defeated yourself. Do you want to go in? Definitely. Then proceed. Here we go, guys. We are taking our first step inside of the Pokemon League, and now we are going to be starting with the room here on the left. I've received a lot of really great tips from you guys, so thank you so much. I do feel very confident about the challenge we're about to take on, and it looks like a magical staircase has appeared for us. Let's go ahead and walk up it, and it looks like someone is waiting for us at the top. Now, I'm going to go ahead and go with the tips that you guys gave me, and I'm going to put Barky up in front for this fight. I think that's going to be the best decision we can make, so let's go ahead and talk to this mysterious person. Whoa, the room went dark, uh, everything has fallen, and it seems like uh, something's going on here. There's a, there's a supernatural aura around here, and I think it might be coming from her, so let's go ahead and talk to her. There's one man who wanders the world with a white dragon Pokemon to search for truth. That's part of a novel I'm writing. I want to write down the event that happened on that day. Sorry, it has nothing to do with you. You're a challenger, right? I'm the Elite Force Ghost-type Pokemon user, Chantal, and I shall be your opponent. Here we go, Rodri versus Elite Force Chantal, the Ghost Type Master. Let's go ahead and do this, guys. We are challenged by Elite Force Chantal and her four Pokemon. She is the first of the Elite Four, and I am very excited to be taking her on. All right, come on out, Barky. Let's see what you can do, my friend. And uh, let's get to work, guys. As you can see, we do outlevel the Coffer Grigus, which is pretty dang good, but honestly, it still makes me a little bit nervous. We do have a move that's going to be super effective on it. But the downside to this is just Coffer Grigus is very annoying. Um, a very, very annoying Pokemon. And it honestly, it does a lot of damage too. So we'll see how this goes. I'm thinking that Barky was the right choice though. First impressions are everything. Let's go for the crunch. You know what? I think first impressions are important, but I, I don't agree that they're everything. Oh my gosh, we almost took it down. Ah, it was so close. Are you kidding me right now? Oh, okay, I'm gonna go for another one. I'm guessing Chantal is gonna use a full restore, of course. And I'm pretty sure that we are actually faster than Cofagrigus, um, if I am correct. So we should be able to take it down, hopefully, with the next hit. All right, here we go, guys. Cross our fingers. We're gonna be going for the crunch. And with that, we have took down Chantal's first Pokemon. The Cofagrigus is down, and we are moving on, guys. We are rolling through here. Uh, let's see what's gonna come out next. It's gonna be a Golurk. Ooh, I know who to send out for this. Come on out, Nagini. Yeah, let's do this. This is so exciting. I love going up against the Elite Four. It's probably some of my favorite things to do is just, like, go up against them, take them on. There's just something very, very exciting about going up against Elite Four members. I'm going to be going with the Leaf Blade. I think that should pretty much take the Golurk down. Um, it's going to be super effective on it. If I'm correct, Golurk is Ghost uh, Rock or Ghost Ground, one of those. Um, so I'm hoping that, you know, well, we'll do some good damage here. I'm going to go for the Giga Drain, which should... Finish off the Golurk, and now we're able to move on to Chantal's third Pokemon. So there we have it, guys. Good work. Good tips from everybody. We're doing awesome, um, and it's a it's an exciting time. Uh, who's going to come out next? Chandelure. Hmm. I'm going to bring out Nadar for Chandelure. Uh, Fire Ghost, if I'm correct. So let's go ahead and do it. Nadar is actually really, really high leveled right now, too. Um, so it shouldn't be much trouble for us. Uh, oh, we're the same level, actually. Okay, not bad. Um, we should probably gain a level off of this once we take down the Chandelure. Hopefully it does a lot of damage. Yeah! Oh, come on! I almost had it down in one hit! 
All right, good job, Nadar. Good, good job. Um, a, a lot of these Pokemon only have the move Shadow Ball, which would, which is what I've realized. Holy crap, not a crit. All right, I'm gonna go for another Surf. We are faster than it, and with that, okay, uh, not bad. Um, there goes Chandelure. So um, I think that was Chantal's strongest Pokemon too. So with that, our team's doing great, guys. Our, uh, our awesome team of six is kicking some butt. We just gotta see who's coming out next. Driplin. Oh, okay. I'm gonna bring out Aza. All right, let's, let's hope Aza can finish the job here. The only downside to this is that some of the moves are gonna be super effective on Aza since Aza's psychic. Um, it's not over yet. I'll finish it my way. The pro, though, is that we also do have Shadow Ball and Ghost. Super effective on Ghost. Uh, maybe we can even take down this Driplin. Oh, that did a lot. All right, come on, come on. You can tank it out, Aza. You can tank it out. Come on, Aza, come on, Aza. Thank you, there we go. I hope for a good ending. I hate endings that leave a bitter taste in one's mouth. That was so bad. She hates endings that leave a bitter taste on her. I'm not, I'm, no comment. Let's go for the Shadow Ball. With that, Drip Flim is down. Good job, Aza. And uh, it looks like we've took down Chantal's fourth Pokemon. So with that, guys, Ace Rogue grew to level 56. We defeated Elite Four Chantal. Do you ever feel at a loss for words when something greatly moves you? To tell the truth, I'm a writer, but right now I'm having trouble putting my feelings into words. You were just that impressive. We got 6960 for winning. My Pokemon and the Challenger's Pokemon. Everyone battled even though they were hurt. Thank you. Fortitude is needed if you're going to battle, don't you think? Because both you and your opponent get hurt. But if you don't understand the pain, you'll focus on the result and forget about the bonds with your Pokemon. That's why I want to write passages full of heart and soul in my novels. All right, so with that, guys, it seems like we have took down Elite Four Chantal, and it's very exciting times, guys. Next up, we will be moving on to the second Elite Four member. If you guys have any tips, let me know. One Elite Four member down, three more to go. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. Goodbye.